I'm Rob Stewart. And I'm his wife, Carrie, and we're professional cruisers. And yes, that is a real job. We spent over 100 nights at sea. We even got married on a cruise ship. It's our favorite way to travel. And when it comes to vacations, nothing is better than cruising. Whether it's a large ocean ship or an intimate riverboat, cruising has never been more popular. And with so many choices, making a decision can be a little intimidating, especially if you've never been on a cruise. But not to worry. We're going to show you what you need to know before you set sail. And we'll even do a little myth busting because just about everything has changed since back in the days of the love boat. By the way, if you're a millennial, forget that love boat reference. Now pay attention because later we're gonna show you how to pay for your cruise interest free and on your terms. The number one question we get as travel agents from first time cruisers is what's included in the price? Your well appointed cabin, including your very own cabin steward who will take care of you your entire trip. They may even show you the secret behind those towel animals. And don't worry, you will never go hungry because all your food is included. We're talking breakfast, brunch, lunch, afternoon snacks, dinner, even midnight snacks. Like when it's midnight and we're watching a movie in our cabin and we're too lazy so we order room service. Okay, moving on. <laughs> Entertainment's included from Broadway style shows to comedy clubs, piano bars, one man bands, to even full musical groups. And God help us, karaoke. Let's just say that's <laughs> not for everybody. And if you have to take your kids with you, don't worry, you can still ship them off to the kids club. Hey, you said you didn't film that. One thing we love about cruising is that no matter what time it is, you can always find some fun things to do. If you're adventurous and not afraid to fall, you can try surfing at sea. Instead, we chose ice dance, I mean, ice skating. How about a movie under the stars or a late night party? Not me, I'm going shopping. <laughs> no problem, I'll be at the spa. And if kicking back with a frosty cold beverage is more your style, there are bars all over the place where you can grab a drink, then head to the pool, hot tub, and on some ships, an enclosed solarium. When we come back, we are going to show the most popular places around the world that you can take a cruise. Let's go! When you're driving a car that has a 328 horsepower engine, you might want some things like direct adaptive steering and adaptive shift control for more precision. You'll also want a closed off dam with pylons and a helicopter to film all your epic moves. Handle the Q50 at your local Infinity retailer. If you're coming downtown, if you live downtown, and you're gonna eat dinner, you wanna have lunch, you wanna check out an art gallery, you wanna go right to downtownstp.com. You get to meet online these key personalities that run these businesses. Our city, I think, after being to 300 of them, over 35 countries, I think downtown St. Pete and St. Petersburg is the most magical place to live. Nova 535 is my gift to St. Petersburg. We do one event at a time, we do a great job on it, and we focus on the client. The best part of downtownstpete.com is Stand the heat. Get off the test track. Get the Mercedes Benz you've been burning for at the summer event going on now at your authorized Mercedes Benz dealer. Hurry before this opportunity cools off. Let's go! When you decide to take a cruise, you get to unpack once and yet travel to multiple places. If you want to relax, kick back, and enjoy some of the best beaches in the world, you can't go wrong with the Caribbean, which happens to be the most popular cruise destination in the world. If you love wildlife and adventure, Alaska is the place for you. Whales breaching, glaciers calving, and beautiful views. If history, culture, and architecture sound interesting, you have to check out Europe. Whether a river cruise through the heart of Europe or a cruise around the Mediterranean, you are sure to see some sights that will take your breath away. Don't think you can afford a cruise? Think again. Earlier we mentioned how you can pay for a cruise interest-free, and here's how you do it. 
Find a ship or sailing that you like, even if it's a year or more away. Put down a refundable deposit that's very small, lock in the price, and then make small interest-free payments whenever you want. Once a month, once a quarter, it doesn't matter as long as you're paid in full by the final payment date, which usually is 60 to 90 days from the sale date. Cancel before then and you get a full refund. The best way to do this is through your travel agent. There's a lot to know about cruising. For more pro tips, pick up a copy of our book, Just Add Water, your guide to the ultimate cruise vacation. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next week right here on CW44. The things that we put ourselves through to bring you this show, I know, it is tough.